Does metadata make you feel intimidated, confused, scared? Don't worry, we can help. Here are Lizzie and Molly, Minitech's metadata experts. Descriptive metadata is just a fancy word for information about a book, a movie, music, or anything really. You use metadata all the time. It's part of your everyday life. It's labels, instructions. It's how your computer magically makes music mixes. And why Amazon suggests items for you to purchase. Metadata is the who, what, where, when, why. This photo has it. And the Stone Arch Bridge has it. Metadata has lots of details. The point of metadata is to make connections and provide context. It calls out what is the same. And what is different. Metadata shows us relationships and helps us understand them. Remember James J. Hill? If we add him to our metadata, it connects us to other stuff related to him. He was born in Canada in 1838. A bow and arrow accident blinded him in the right eye when he was a child. He was an enormously successful railroad tycoon. He lived here. Here's a library named after him. And here's where he tried to breed a hybrid beef dairy cow. <laughs> you know when you get a nickname like Empire Builder, you're a pretty big deal. So, now we know a lot about James J. Hill, but how does metadata fit in? Metadata makes information coherent and usable. It links items on maps, helps you create timelines, choose your next Netflix show, or find a historic photo of your hometown. It's totally not scary. Or intimidating. Metadata, metadata is... Want to learn more? 